Hello again, folks, and welcome back to Let's Play as the Beholder. I'm your host, the Game of Darius. Last we left off, I had to take a little bit of a stint of looking things up, as per the usual. And uh, I have a general idea of where it is that I need to go now. So this was that room. I gotta implement some more right wall strats here. Because... I think I gotta go to the museum. And that museum uh, has a bunch of things in it, but most importantly, hi, arrow. <laughs> most importantly, though, I believe that, that way was progress. All the way down here. Go ahead and save. 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 Now uh, you walk in here initially and it's all like a bunch of things and stuff. Um, those were apparently just statues. Evidently. All right, that's the teleporter. There's a long ass hallway. Hello. My name is Flind. Flind the Knoll. Hi. I actually kind of like it that Eliza is the one mostly hitting most of the time. I don't know. I like Darius. He is the OG character of mine, but... Sometimes. Sometimes. You just gotta really like the new characters, you know? Right. Okay, so this is... One of these places. Kill things, receive gemstone, put into eye. Progress. Excellent, excellent, excellent. Um, right. Was there something added extra with this one? Hmm. Let me try going the other way. Aha, yep. Wait, is that one? Yeah, that one's a little weird. Uh, there's clearly not... Clearly not multiple sprites dependent on... Huh. It was four eyes, right? Can't go that way. Uh, right. Okay. <laughs> ah, gods. Okay, there's got to be some sort of a sequence I'm missing then. Let me try going backwards. Because what I'm thinking is happening is that I'm getting twisted, turned around. Because I definitely did not... Dang it. Just when you think you figured it out. Or maybe I gotta... Do I have to take out the eyes? I think I just turned myself around completely and totally. Wait, south? It did. It teleported me... You sneaky son of a gun. All right, prepare arrow. <laughs> All right. Pointing south. And pointing south again. All 
This game's com discombobulating me and I hate it. And then it points me east. Yeah, it's teleporting me. This is the way I came out of that. Okay. I want to go this way first. Yeah, there it is. There it is. All right. And uh, that's not a gemstone. That's a gemstone. It's already filled. That one's already filled. It's doing that thing. Eh? Eh. Yep, okay. So pointing north points me west. Hate these kind of puzzles. Only because it it takes a lot of my own personal brain power to try to figure the hell out uh, how and why it's turning me. Mm -hmm. I would know this. I don't even remember if this is anything in particular. Northwest. Yeah, it teleports me. Okay, I see where the two points are. If I'm pointing west here, wait. Hold the phone a second. Ah. Okay, this is where I slotted some nulls. And this is already done. Yeah. Pressing the wrong buttons had ended up freaking discombobulating me again. Okay. Now let's go back. Okay. I'm at the entrance of these shenanigans. So, jewel there. There is teleporter here. And teleports me pretty much to the opposite side of the thing. Now, I know that there's none there. There's one there. So essentially, Let's go the opposite way. Okay, there's one on the east one. One on the north one. One on the southern one. Logically speaking, I just need to get the west one. Game, please. Ha ah, ha ha ha. It looked pierced. It's pierced that I got the puzzle. Chain mail. <laughs> Imagine being uh, the big bad of this area, being all like. 
They got my puzzle. Uh, so it wasn't that hard. And I'm mocking the guys saying that when it took me a solid 10 plus minutes to try to figure that out. Let's not mock the quote unquote mastermind of this place, shall we? All right, I don't think it matters which one of these we go down, but I'm happy to say that we finally get to go down. Oh, I'm going to quickly save because I know what's down here. I hate what's down here. <laughs> All right. Oh, crap. Oh. I'm in the maze of this crap. Great. Fantastic. Superb. I love it. That no one ever. Well, that's not a creepy noise in the side. I just don't know what you're talking about. I want to say that the tr that a trick to this area would be to simply not hit through the web. I want to say that'd be the trick. But alas, there are things and stuff in some of these areas that I want to get to. Think. Eh? Hmm. Not that. But yeah, my theory is that hitting the, hitting and destroying them, anyways. Where's a, that's a dwarven key. Uh, kind of more or less summons a spider. And I'd rather not face the spiders yet. Not until I have neutralized poison. Part of me thinks that's not going to happen, though. Frick. Okay, wait, wait, wait. I'm in a little dead-end place right here. I need to go forward. Let's avoid that. North? Shoot. Okay. Prepare your spells. The sooner this thing dies, the sooner I don't have to worry about dying. Magic missile. Throw the dagger. Did I not get poisoned? Don't jinx it. Yes, I'm immediately yelling at myself not to jinx. Ah, no, there it goes. All right. Speed run time. Good rocks. Brick. Come on, where are you? You ugly son of a bitch. Hit things with acid. Okay. A ring. Cool. Put it on. Arrow. This is not the place I wanted to come to yet. Oh no, I needed to go south. That was it. Shoot. Didn't need to go north. I needed to go south. Because this... Dungeon does a weird roundabouty thingy. Uh, 
Your light wounds. That was actually a pretty good cure light wounds for once. Way to go, Iggy. Heck. Because I could have sworn that what it was is that one of these areas doesn't really loop back, but it loops around and up. Was that extra healing? Yeah. I'm mildly lost. Shoot. Nope. Come on. Cleave him. Cleave him half. Chop him up. Leg by leg if you must. Blessings. Keep on forgetting the blessings. Okay, we did need this, so that's a that's a plus. Exactly what I was looking for. I was looking for a key. Alright, this goes back and around. I was looking for a key. Alright. I should... As soon as I remember which way I'm going. Oh, hi. Wait, how? Th okay. <laughs> like, wait, did that hit Tiberius? But no, it didn't hit Tiberius. It hit Eliza. Or the poison hit Eliza. I just went around in a circle twice. Eck. You. Monstrosity. Of Lolf. Okay, down twice, over this way, north is not the way. Do they reconstitute these things? Oh, if that's the case, I hate it. Oh, I hate it more than usual, let's put it that way. Give my arrow. Bastards. Eight-legged freaky bastards. Okay, that's the way I came in. Heck off. Shoot. I would gloriously miss like that, wouldn't I? Great, now both of us are poisoned. I would love, 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 love be able to simply cure this. Alright, this is where uh, if we were super unfortunate, you know, more unfortunate than we already are. Love of Okay. That down. This up. GTFO. I'm gonna save really quickly. Have a game. I know it's not exactly the most optimal to be saving when we're, you know, dying, but there is uh is it these. Yes, I know, guys. I'm sorry. We will have cure so many cure light wounds left. No, I can take it. Hmm. Gaming God out there. They hate me. Uh, Mesa. Okay. 
Right. Okay. That's that. That's one of the gargoyles. Dwarven key. Excellent. That's one of those. Please don't die on me, guys. Okay. Is the freaking drow cleaver? All this time, I'm running around like a goddamn chicken with my head cut off, and the freaking drow cleavers. Oh my god. I say this as we're about to die. I didn't even pull a chain. You know what? Whatever. I'm looking for a dwarven rune. One that says safe passage. Yep. Oh. Right. That one goes. Okay. Ninja Dwarf lies on the ground before you, nearly unconscious from his wounds. Tend to him. Having regained his strength, the dwarf thanks you. I thought that I had met my death at the blade of that drow. In battle, our king was grievously wounded, and the young prince kidnapped. I tried to stop the drow, but alas, I was overcome. You have saved me from death. I wish there was a way, some way to thank you, but I have nothing. I am alone, separated from my people during the battle. May I join you so that, I might, so that together we may search for my people. As Tygor joins their party, he says, During the battle, I chased my enemy up a staircase to this level. My people should be on the level just, be just below us. Great. Uh, I need to find those stairs down. Iggy, do you have... <sighs> I've doomed me. Go up. Did I completely blitz by Tagor? <sighs> there we go. Well, presuming that we don't run into any more spiders, I should just be able to resurrect her once we get to uh, the bad... The good place with a bad foot. The same goes for Darius. Hmm. Okay. I'm vaguely... I think I did have to pull that chain. Dwarven keys. Was that it? Could have sworn that there was a second or third one that I need to push. Uh, Tiger is not looking too hot, but he and Iggy would be better to take the front line. When Darius finally kicks the bucket. Alright. This is the long way, but this goes to... There it goes. Uh, this goes to... A room where there's creepily no... Funky noises going on. Hmm. No secret buttons. Rats that look like men. Pear. How big is this chamber? Like three by, right? Yeah, it's three by. Okay, I think I see where I am. Because there's going to be another three by chamber right here. With literally nothing in it. Hmm. 
Like, this is also a three by room. What the shit? Oh, hello. Uh, yeah, yeah. Kind of amazed that there's not as any more spiders outside of the. Uh, oh, there's the stairs down. Excellent. Kind of amazed that there's not any more spiders outside of its confined areas. Scale mail. Hey, that would go lovely on Eliza if she were living. Go to Worm and Key. That goes around in pointless circles. Yes, I did back up a little bit there just to be all like, mm, was this something I missed? We have a rune for safe passage, which means that this should be the pantry. I hear how close those clicking noises are supposed to be the spiders. And I kind of hate it. Hello. I am Armon, spokesman of this clan. Of course, we have information on the location of the exits from these halls. But in our hour of need, I have no time to help you. However, you'd be willing to help us. Armon begins. Our clan is descended from the dwarves who built these great halls. Here, our ancestors lived in peace until hordes of evil creatures drove them out and into the realms of men and elves. On the surface, our numbers dwindled. Finally, our leader, King Tyrgor, Tyrgo, gathered up our people and led us underground in search of our ancestral home. Using secret knowledge passed down through the royal family, we finally discovered these stone-carved halls. The halls were vast, and, our, and we only explored a small portion before we had to make camp in an enclosed area decorated with a stone portal. But while the camp slept, the stone portal flared with magical light. From the light, a horde of drow charged us. They were led by a female they called Shindia. We rose up and fought the Dark Ones, though we were exhausted by long weeks' travel. Both sides suffered many casualties, but in the end we forced them to retreat into the portal from which they came. The battle was costly. King Tyrgor, 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 Tyrgor was wounded by a poison dagger, and now lies in eternal sleep. Nothing our cleric can do can wake him. His only son, Prince Kyrgar, was captured by the invading drow. With no member of the royal family among us, we no longer have access to their secret knowledge of the e bleh, of the exits of these halls. Now we wait, while our cleric heals our surviving warriors. Once prepared, we will try to rescue our prince and avenge the fall of Tyrgor. Our numbers are small, but we would rather fight to our deaths than abandon our prince to the drow. Unless, if a party were to rescue Prince Kyrgar from the drow and return him to us, he would give us give you the information about the exits from these holes. You would have your information and we'd have our prince. So will you help us, brother? <laughs> Armin accepts your help with gratitude. He hands you a medallion made of stone. Take this. Shindia dropped it in the battle. It is the key to activate the portal with through which she and her minions came. Our ancestors built the portals to transport them from one location to another quickly. When the portal doorway is touched with the right object, the portal is activated. We would have followed Shindia and her drow elves back through the portal, but we are not ready to confront them. The Ancient Ones also used powerful magic such as this to gain knowledge. Legend has it that there is an oracle of knowledge, and the key to its or operation is the powerful black orb. By placing an orb into the oracle, its power is released. Our cleric can help heal your wounds. Be careful not to tax him too heavily. He has been healing the wounds of our warriors and trying to revive the king from his poisoned sleep. Armin stops you. One more thing. A young dwarven warrior would like to join you in your quest to find the prince. Would you allow him? Nah. He reluctantly remains with his people. Yay! We got the stone medallion. And some rations. I like rations. Gonna take all the rations. We're gonna keep keep Tagor along just cause. Hi. Also hi. 
The weary dwarven cleric would see you. Yes, I'm gonna help you resurrect people. Oh man, you resurrected the full. All right. Uh, I'm gonna quickly. All right then. I'm gonna quickly. Yoink. Oh, no, not that. I say quickly. Uh, I'm just going to activate this. Activate. No. Dagger? We were just handed the medallion, weren't we? Okay. Um. Huh. I'm clearly missing something. Besides a scroll of haste. And a cleric scroll of aid. What am I missing? A necklace. Did they not give me a necklace? They gave me the medallion. Hi. In theory, I should... <laughs> I, I'm able to attack these dwarves. Uh, that'd be suicide, however, so let's not do that. And that was the Dwarven Passage for... Okay, that's if I fell from the fourth level, which... Thankfully, now that I found the Drow Cleaver, I will never have to go back to again. He says, really hoping that he did not forget something in the... Fourth level. Because what I wanted to do was quickly teleport out of here. Using the correct... Is this a medallion? No. Using the correct thing of a burb. Uh, quickly return and resurrect. Oh, there it is. Yes. And then we'll quickly give this to. The one whose inventory isn't full. Uh, and then we're going to return right back. Boop. Boop. Because I want everyone in tip a top of ship before we go down any further than we are. Uh, right. Full inventory is up the wazoo. That's only slightly annoying. As with that constant clicking noise. Holy shit. Part of me really does want to go and kill the remainder spiders for the sheer purpose of never having to hear this noise again. All right. Quick memorize. Actually, wait. Uh, scrib. Armor. Visibility. Fireball. Fireball. And haste. Um... Memorize. More magic missiles. Acid arrow. Fireball. And that should be it. Then pray for spells. One remaining here. So let's go ahead with another whole person. Um, prayer? I think prayer works the same as... Um... What's the word I'm looking for? Prayer works the same as meditation did in the SNES version. Oh man, I freaking found the Drow Cleaver. Yes! It's all my yes. Alright, I'm gonna go ahead, save, sorry for this slightly longer episode, and call an episode here. When we return, we shall finally delve into the darkness of the sewers below Waterdeep. Further forward and slay a bunch of Drow. Well, thank you everyone so very much for watching. I hope you guys are enjoying this series as much as I'm enjoying playing it again. And as always, I hope to see you guys in the next video. Take care. Cheers.